Hey nerdlings, Nick Lotus 84 back with another episode of Asagao Academy with Ultimate Carl. Yo yo. And we just finished class. PBG did not show up today. And so <gasps> we got uh, the notes from the teacher. We're going to go see him. And Mai is, uh, of course, throwing out the hints of, you know, oh, ev every, no, it's the opposite of I have a crush on every boy. Every boy has a crush <laughs> on you, Hana. Mai is just convinced that every dude wants to jump Hana's bones. So good. Yeah, so she... <laughs> She's got volleyball practice, but we're gonna brave the boys' dorm to take PBG those notes. I told you, I don't think he feels that way. Before I could say anything more, she left the room. Hmm. Hmm. 400, 401, 402, here it is! I paused in front of his door, my heart in my throat. I suddenly felt horribly stupid about bringing this to him. It wasn't like he would even look at it. He said himself that he hated school. But what if he was dying in there? John went to the drama club. He wouldn't be back for a few hours. I guess that means John and PBG are roommates. Sucking it up, I knocked on the door. Who is it? Um, uh, it's Hana. I brought some notes from... The door swung open before I could finish my sentence. PBG beamed down at me. Hana. Hannah, hi! Hey! Hi! Come in! Come in! Uh, thanks. I stepped into a messy room. Posters lined the walls, and small Harvest Noon plushies were piled up on one of the beds. <laughs> yes, which I assumed to be PBGs. This is a I pretty, like the poster on the left. This is a pretty great poster. Well, that was, oh, I like the one on I the left. That's that. just the duck hunt. That's it's, amazing. Yeah. TV was on in the center of the room. Turby twinkled happily from the pause menu. Turby. <laughs> I love it. You were playing games? Huh? Oh, yeah. PBG closed the door behind me. Um. I didn't feel like going to class today, so I thought I'd stay in and do some work. <laughs> this was me in college. <laughs> work? Well... Well... We do have a tournament coming up. What fucking game tournament do you play, as you play Kirby at? I don't know. This is kind of. I mean, I guess if you're playing Smash, yeah. but if you don't play Kirby in that game, doesn't play anything as he does in his own games. Yeah, at all. I brought you the stuff we went over in class. Oh, thank you. He took the papers out of my hands and set them on a desk next to a small stack of manga. I'm glad you're feeling well. Were you worried that I was sick? Sorry. <laughs> but that's adorable, so I'm kind of happy about it. Oh my gosh, PPG, stop being adorable. Do you get this scene if you didn't want to go to his game? Yeah, you get this scene anyway, I okay. think. I got this, I, when I when I did my John playthrough, I got, I got this scene still. What? Do you want to hang out? We have to work on our project at some point anyways, right? Well, I didn't really have anything else planned. Great! He plopped into a beanbag and slapped a pillow down next to him. Do you want to play? No, I'm not too good at games. I think I'll just I wasn't watch. talking about games. No, ho, ho. Well, he, he, they are alone in his room. Huh. Okay, then. Or maybe he was. Maybe he's excited to have her alone so he can kill her off, and John will be all his again. <laughs> yes. He unpaused the game. Turby sprinted across the screen, shooting fireballs from his mouth. PBG and I didn't talk much. Instead, I commented on the game and laughed at him when he died. <laughs> Noob. Hey, I'm Grump. <laughs> Before I knew it, the sun was setting, and I had to leave. You're welcome back anytime. Actually. We're having a Stomping Sisters tournament in two days. You can come if you want. I'm trying to figure out Stomping Sisters. I think it's supposed I guess, to be like, like Mario Brothers. Brothers. Or yeah, I guess true. Yeah, it's Smash Brothers. Yeah, Smash Brothers. Because if they're doing a tournament of it, yeah. Yeah. Really? Sure. See ya. Awesome. It'll be at noon in this room. I'll see you there. Or here, I guess. Yep. I left the dorm and stepped out into the fading sunlight. The air was warm, 
filled with the smell of freshly cut grass. Uh. I couldn't put my finger on it, but something about being around PBG was comforting. Maybe like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> a PB and J. Oh man, I just made it a totally unintentional double entendre about uh, <laughs> oh, PBG yeah. and John in their room. Yeah. Anna. Oh my. I don't think I'd rather have a Nutella else. sandwich. Nutella is really good. Shaking my head, I went back to the dorms. She's like, oh my god, you guys, stop coming up with this weird shit. <laughs> hey. Hey, Mai, how did tryouts... <laughs> Hana, close your eyes, don't move. Oh my, what's oh going on in here? Before I could flip on the light switch, something warm collided with me. Whoa. My eyes were covered. Uh, what's going on? <gasps> stop squirming, you'll ruin it. Oh shit, <laughs> what's mm. happening here? Ruin what? Just follow my lead, okay? Mai guided me through the room, telling me where to step. Down. She put her hand on my back and folded me in half, inching me into something that felt like it had a roof. Almost done. What exactly is going on? Yay! And ta-da! I gasped. Bunk bed fort. So cute. My, what is this? What does it look like? It's a pillow fort. I've been looking forward to this for ages. Aww. Tryouts already happened. I made the team easy. I left early because I wanted to set this up for you. And we can't romance her even though she's constantly like sneaking away to set up surprises. For me? Well, for us. You've been such a good friend to me, Hana. I'm so glad we got to be roommates. I wanted to do something for you to make you feel more at home. Because obviously you live inside a fort. <laughs> I've seen how panicked you can be going around school. I don't know what happened in your life, but Asagao is your fresh start, right? You don't have to worry about your evil overlord mother. <laughs> you've got me and you've got this school and normal boots too. If you're up for it, this can be your new life. Where you won't have to murder anyone. You don't ever have to look back. Wow. And now, now is when we can play. My. Yeah. Yes, I knew it. I totally knew you were going to cry. I love watching girls cry. <laughs> I guess this means I was successful. Ah, uh, my, you've done it again. My! <laughs> I slammed her into a hug. Body slammed, that is. Whoa, be careful. You don't want to break it. This took me forever. My, I was bullied at my old school. That's why I came here. And it was only because my dad gave up everything to afford it. I thought you wouldn't like me, and I have a hard time trusting people. But if you wanted to, I think we could be lovers, <laughs> best friends. Oh God, now I'm gonna cry. Besties, officially! Yay! Yes, let's be friends, BFFs. Yes. I'm so happy. Oh, and she cried. <laughs> <laughs> me too. Together, we're unstoppable! Especially when we fuse, I'll say! Let's hook you and Jared up! <laughs> Alright! Wait, I, I can't even speak to him without self-destructing! It's fine! There's no way he couldn't fall for you! Oh yeah? And no one's caught your eye yet? Huh? <laughs> I'd say there's more than a few suitors on your horizon. <laughs> Aren't you going to give it a shot? Me? Dating? Well, this is a date sim. Yeah, my eyes shifted across the fort my made, the stuffed rabbit sitting on my bed, the window with the view of Asagao's manicured lawn. My life changed so much, so quickly. You know, maybe I could. Yeah! 
Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Well, I prepared some activities for us to do. Look! Activities, you say? <laughs> so much room for activities. <laughs> that's, it's like Step Brothers. We've even got the bunk beds already. Yeah. <laughs> she pulled out a tablet and opened an app. We're going to marathon you through Avatar. <laughs> We're going to watch Avatar, awesome. <laughs> Sweet. Everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. Er, I don't know. Too late. She pressed play. As evening faded into night, we huddled in the blanket fort, watching episode after episode and messing with each other. Happier than I'd been for a long time, I rested my head on my shoulder. Yeah. Before I knew it, I'd fallen asleep. As usual, the next day, Mai and I got to school early, still poking fun at each other for our moment the night before. But as we approached Poppy Hall, I noticed something felt different. A palpable tension hung in the air. It was almost humid. Man, what is up with everyone? I don't know. I don't know. Is there a test today? Not that I know of. But as we entered the building and turned the corner, it suddenly made sense. Jared and Paul were arguing amidst a large crowd, spit flying from their mouths while Nick and Josh walked along the hallway, pasting posters of Paul's face over Jared's modeling shots. I thought I told you to stop and take those posters down. No, what's wrong? Wait, which, which one is yeah, Josh? Yeah, you're, 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 you're Josh and I'm Nick. Yeah, right. No, what's wrong with you? These walls are everybody's space. We don't have to listen to you. And you should know that this campaign is way more important than your little fashion show. No. But mine were here first. Lay off them. This is between you and me, Jared, darling. Leave them out of it. You've been taking up all the wall space with your show. The student elections are much more important. It's our government. The student government doesn't even do anything. Whoa, whoa, whoa. As current president, I can say with full knowledge and proper authority that the student government does a ton for this school. You don't even know, Jared. You don't even know, darling. My, what does the student government actually... My? She wasn't with me anymore. She pried herself between <laughs> Jared and Paul and was pushing them apart. I ran forward to help her. Uh, you guys should stop. Hana. 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 I flinched. Sorry, Hana. I didn't mean to yell. I... We want your opinion on something. You're a regular student, a new student. You aren't involved. Which do you think is more important, darling? Our student government or the fashion show? Oh, and in the next episode, we will make this choice. Until next time, thanks for watching. Later.